What's up guys, uh, today I'm actually not going to be doing a challenge, I haven't had time to do it this week, and I apologize, but today I'll be talking about the half marathon, which I ran yesterday, today's Monday, yesterday was Sunday, I ran it on Sunday, yeah, I ran in the Chile half marathon, it was in Burlington, it was a nice race, uh, went along Lakeshore and back, I was number 239. I meant to say 2394, that was my bad, not 239, because as you can see, my bib number is 2394. That was my bib. I finished in 2 hours, 5 minutes, 22 and a half seconds, which isn't too bad. I could have done much better, but I blew up both my knees and had to have physio on them. I came in 1,607th place out of 2,832, which isn't too bad, roughly about the middle of the pack, a bit lower. I was doing well until about 10 kilometers, and then, like, I just got really tired. I I didn't do much training for it because the weather has been pretty bad outside, lots of snow. Of course, like I said, my knees, which uh, I couldn't run. My physiotherapist said I wasn't able to run with my knees, so I couldn't do much training. My goal is for my next half marathon is to run under... 12, two hours, which is which would be five minutes and twenty two and a half seconds faster than I ran yesterday, which I think I can do with some training. This is the medal I got. It's actually a really nice medal. It the race was part of the the Discovery Ford Race Series, and that's what the medal looks like up close. It says Chile Half Marathon Finisher, and there's like some sparkles and glitter. Also got. A jacket. It's pretty nice. It has the logo here. And inside I wrote my time and place. So whenever I put the jacket on I'll remember that I can do better. The next half marathon I'm running is actually in Ottawa on May 26th. And I'm pretty excited for that because I've never ran in Ottawa. And I also have never ran in Burlington. So it was pretty nice. It's better running in places you haven't seen because you can kind of explore and see how where everything is rather than in running in your hometown which you see basically everything all the time so it's like the same thing all the time. I also want to say thank you to everyone who has subscribed to me. I know I've reached over 100 subscribers and I will do the Trinidad Scorpion Hot Peppers but I have to order them so you have to give me some time to get them but I promise I will do them. Forgive me for not making a challenge, I haven't had much time, as I said, with the marathon and basically just not doing much for the days leading up into it because I wanted to rest up. I will make a challenge next week. Well, thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed listening about my race experience and I hope you stay tuned for future challenges and videos. I would really appreciate it if you haven't subscribed to me, you can subscribe up here or check down here and watch my, my past videos. Thanks for watching guys, that's it for today, and I'll see you next Monday when I do another challenge. Peace!